um, now in their 70s, have been friends for 50, 60 years, and uh, they've reached a point where they no longer have to be polite to each other. And in the play, they both dated the same girl some 30 years ago, and uh, they got in a fight about that, and so they've never spoken about it since. And all of a sudden, they get a phone call. Who? Oh my God, of course I remember you. And she wants to see them tomorrow. And all of their rivalry comes right back to where it was 30 years ago. And they're drinking, and that's where it all begins. I've been writing actually for quite a few years. I wrote for television first. I wrote some uh, sitcom scripts, uh, first for New Heart, when my wife was on, and for a show called um, Parenthood. But I, I disliked it intensely. Um, the, uh, the pressure from the studios uh, and the head writer on the show is, is immense. Um, they would change all my lines. <laughs> And uh, so I gave that up rapidly. And then I took up plays, because I figured, well, a play I can probably get done. And so um, I'm on my sixth play now. And this is the first one that's being done. You know, that's a beautiful place. I, I love it. I would, I, would, I would love to be permanently attached to it. <clears throat> Um, the stage itself is unusual in that it's a, a sandwich uh, situation with audience on two sides and two blank sides. Uh, I, I don't think I've ever seen a theater set up like that. Uh, it it uh, presents uh, certain problems for the director to make sure everybody can see everything that's going on, but no more than theater in the round. Um, so. Um, I think Donna's uh, doing a good job with it. I've seen one uh, complete rehearsal so far and uh, it looked very good. I think I'm very pleased, I'm very pleased with everything. Uh, the actors, the stage, the director, all of it. 